What up guys, I'm posting a figure review, and by the way, I'm going to be doing these about once a week. Um, I picked this guy up yesterday, and I wanted to critique him, because I want, I, I want, to, ha I want to critique more uh, figures for this site, so I'm going to critique him. So, this is the Punisher, if you don't already know, and here's the front package. Now... The th I mean, I it looks pretty cool. I mean, I thought it, out of ever out of all the figures I, f I was looking at at Target, this is probably the coolest one. I thought. Now, something that's a little bothering me already with the packages, he's got this gun, but he didn't have a shotgun in the selection. Look at that. He's got an Uzi. He's got two pistols, and he's got a knife, but he has no he has no shotgun. Okay, and another thing I'm not happy about, I don't like is, um, he's got the shading on the white, but he doesn't have this shading that you see here. I think that's a problem with some of these comic book characters with the figures and statues is that that's why they don't look as good as they do in the comic book or in the animation movie because they incorporate the, they don't incorporate these shadings. If they did, it would look so much more exciting than it is, but let's turn him over. Another thing I don't like is it's not the same character here. It doesn't look like this. See, these don't look the same. Look at that. They don't look the same. Okay. Looking at the package. Here's his little character bio. I'll read it. Some say justice is blind. In this case, justice comes armed to the teeth. Less concerned with stopping crime as he is with whipping out criminal criminals the punisher shows no mercy to those who have crossed the line and he does not play around if you've watched his movies and seen read his comics you will know that he takes no for an answer and let me see what else got a warning sign so you don't choke on your figures ages four and up so it's not a bad package okay and it says here with his little dog collect them all and then else we have Marvel Nova, Astonishing Wolverine, and Thanos. All right, let's get this bad boy opened up. And Harry is out of the box, all right? And he looks, his body sculpt's pretty good. I like it. He comes with, let me move my camera down. Four accessories. He comes with a knife. Focus camera, come on. Bent. Comes with uh, two pistols. These look like the pistols that Tom Jane had in the his Punisher. And we come with a Uzi style gun. It's pretty good detail. And that's next to my palm of my hand. This figure stands about four inches I checked. Yeah, four inches. I mean, that's pretty. Look, look at how small it is. That's in my hand. Okay. Here's a here's his head sculpt. Let's see if I can focus him in. It's a pretty good held sculpt. There's my figure had some sort of boo boo, right? I don't know if the camera can pick it up. Come on, focus. Yeah, I don't think I can pick it up. It's got some black imperfections. Um. And it's a great body, and it's got the shading. I just wish. They would eventually start adding more shading like in this main suit like putting some grays in there just like we see in the comic book but enough with that let's see how the guns fare off he comes with two holsters to put them in voila there's the and then the knife goes on the boot traditionally I would love to make a, a one six scale of this style, classic style Punisher one day. I really, I mean, I love this look. And here's the pistols. Fits in the hands pretty well. I remember I showed a video on the five things I look for in an action figure. And if you haven't seen that, the link is down below. You can watch it. Um, let's see how the Uzi fits in the other hand. Oh, no. Well, there it is in the, the hand, but if I shake it, it probably would come out. And the movement's pretty good. Uh, take it out of the hand. I remember these, like, click. 
if you can hear it, to get them down. I love this movement, the how the torso moves like that. It's restrictive with the belt. It bends at the knee. These kind of restrict it a little bit. The gun, it turns at the leg. It turns at the ankle. Where else is it? The hands turn 360 degrees. They don't flap like this. Elbow turns like that. I really like that joint, this joint. I like the, how that joint is designed. I like the joint, sorry, the camera is loose. I like the joints they chose for this character. Um, it's a cool looking character. Uh, if I were to give it a grade, I'm gonna give it a eight point, let's give it an eight, eight out of 10. That's what I give for this figure. It's uh, pretty good for what I paid for. I think I paid like $12 for it. Um, and I love the Punisher. If you don't already know, I'm a huge Punisher fan. He's, been, he's probably my favorite character in the Marvel Universe. So, all right. Well, that's all I got on the Punisher, guys. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like my Facebook page down below. Don't forget to subscribe. All right. Signing off.